Hello everybody, welcome back to some more Scrap Mechanic Saturdays. Sorry this one's going up a little bit late, I didn't have time to record on Friday, so I am actually recording this on Saturday. And now people have been asking me and telling me and saying in the comments, Yo, there's glass in the game. Glass, 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 glass. I know guys, it's literally my job to play Scrap Mechanic. <laughs> I know when things are added. But I was just waiting for Saturday to do it. I had an idea, back when they first announced glass, I had a cool little idea that I wanted to try. But now that I'm actually looking at it, it's it's not gonna work very well. But I think we, we might just try it just for just for poops and giggles, as they say. Because when I thought of glass and vehicles and flying things and scrap mechanic, all those combined, I merely thought of Wonder Woman's invisible jet. Which is something odd. I've always thought that was pretty odd, because I mean she can fly. But whatever. I think that'd be cool to do. But it's not super clear. Like, I, th I was hoping it'd be lighter. I tried painting it, but I'm, I am I think just a standard is going to be the lightest color you can get. Yeah, that even darkened it a little bit. So it's not going to be super good, but it's been, it's been a while since we actually did a flying vehicle of any sort. So I think we'll try that out. Uh, I have a couple, like, stills from the cartoon pulled up on my other monitor, so we're going to try and attempt to copy that. It's, it's looking all right so far, so that's just the... The canopy, the very beginning, we just have the seat in there. I'll probably put a door in it. Actually, how's that gonna look? Because if we do something like that... Uh, the, everything's gonna look a little weird. Everything that's not glass is gonna stick out a little bit, but... That eh, should be okay. Delete all that. Okay, it's starting to come together, the wings. Kind of going for like a... A swooping look. I'm, I have a, like I said before, I have a still from, I, th I think it's like an old cartoon. I don't know if it's like the Super Friends cartoon or anything. I'm not that familiar with DC, like at all, but I definitely know of this. Uh, and then it has like these like fuselage things, or not fuselage, I don't know, like these pylons on the wings. I might put thrusters there, I'm not sure. But then back here it looks like we've got some sort of tail fin. I'm basically just making it up as I go, just kind of looking at the design and trying to make it a little similar. Not going to be perfectly accurate, but that's not really what we're going for here. Nope, I keep falling off. Luckily, it's low enough that I can just hop back up on the wing. So I've got some engines, I mean thrusters, in place. For all this time in this game, I have like 100 hours, I think I would stop calling them the wrong thing. So I have thrusters in the back and the front to just lift it. And then I have these ones for forward propulsion and those ones as well. And those, I, I'm trying something new I haven't tried before. Okay, let's take this off of that. Hopefully these will actually allow us to turn. I have them going opposite angles. Let's pick that up so we don't hit it. Uh, we're going to try this out now. So one should lift off. I think I got the balance right. There we go. And then we're going to push forward. Okay, can we turn right? Turn left. Uh, turn left, turn left, there's a mountain! This is working way better than I thought it would, but... It looks like we're a little light in the front, I think. Going down! Invisible plane going down! It actually looks kind of cool, having it just be made out of glass. That was a pretty damn good test flight, if you ask me. Yeah, you can see as it lifts off, we're a little bit light in the front. So let's bring her down. <laughs> nice, nice and easy landing. Alright, how are we going to fix this? Um, I could add some more power, because these are already down to one. If I raise them any more, I think that'll be too powerful, because that's what I originally had them on. Yeah. So that's just going to flip up like that. Woo! Oh, almost did a perfect backflip. Not really almost, but you know what I mean. Okay, let's lower those back down. Because that weight distribution was pretty close. It was just barely off. So I added a third thruster to the front, and that's just activated by button. Uh, if we start to lose altitude, hopefully that'll push the nose up a little bit. Uh, but to counteract that, I had to put a third one in the back and hook it up. Looks like we're still a little light in the front. Hmm. Uh, let's try turning that up more. That looks pretty level to me. I think that's as close as we're going to get it for now. That looks pretty good. Okay, so we're lifting off, and now we push forward. Ah, the nose is actually going up too much. Hmm. We could try suspension steering. 
instead of using the thrusters to steer. So I believe that caused our nose to go up a little much. And we're going down. Ah! Boink. Hmm. I have a theory. I think these are too low in our center of gravity that they're pushing the nose up. So how am I going to affect this? It is really handy having it be invisible or clear so I can see everything that's going on. <laughs> it's kind of kind of nice. Oh yeah, that's working much better now. See, I raised those up so now they're more in line with my center of mass. Now we can turn left, we can turn, or that was right, left. Okay, so this is allowing us to change our tilt, but it's not really turning us. What if we, oh, we do complete roll? Oh, that's so cool. I don't think I've seen anyone actually roll, and we're gonna hit the wall. We're gonna hit the wall. Ah! We're gonna get stuck on the wall. <laughs> That's pretty cool. I don't think I've actually seen anyone build a plane in scrap that can actually uh, barrel roll like that. That's pretty neat. I'm sure people have though. Oh, I'm stuck in the ground. Oh, no, no, no. This is not good. Not good at all. Please, someone help me. <laughs> For the love of God. Okay, can we get back into the seats? There we go. Okay. I had to delete one of the thrusters, but there we go. Made it out of there. Let's replace that right there. Oh, uh, these were on full power, were they? Alright. Finally! That is kind of the annoying thing about not being able to rotate things on a... Uh, lift. I really wish you could rotate things. It takes quite a while to walk back over here. Okay, so that test flight seemed to go pretty well. We got that. We can raise the nose. We can roll it. I don't want to go too far though. Come on, complete the roll, complete the roll. And there you go. <laughs> Alright, that works pretty well. Uh, I think we're going to try and add suspension steering. I'm wondering how the suspension steering will work in conjunction with our kind of roll thrusters. We could put those on a button, but I kind of like having them just actually controlled by the, the seat. I don't remember what the maximum amount of bearings you can have uh, connected to a seat is. I don't know if it's like five, just like the engines or what, but... Let's try and toss in some suspension steering. There we go. So we had to use some more non-clear parts. A little annoying, but it should be worth it. So let's hook those up. So steering. Steering. And we go left. Right. Well, let's try this. Left. Oh, they're going the... <laughs> they're the wrong way. Okay. Uh, that's also going to change our weight distribution. Actually, let me check that first. That's not too bad. They're they're kind of in our center of mass. Okay, you go the opposite direction, please. There you go. Okay, so we go left. We go right. Go forward. So now we can go left. Oh, jeez. <laughs> and we're upside down again. Story of my life. Maybe I should just start building things upside down. So when they eventually go upside down, they'll be right side... Up, I guess. <laughs> that makes sense. Uh, people are probably going to tell me to put wheels on and stuff, but... I don't know, I feel like that would just make it look weirder. Uh, I like not having the wheels. Like, maybe if I could make them, like, retractable, but... I don't really think I'm going to be able to do that today. Okay, so left, right. Set her down. You know, it's 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 going pretty well. This is This is working a lot better than I thought it would. Hmm... Let's see. Okay, let's actually do a real test now. So we go up. And now I want to go forward. I'm just going to do a very lightly. Light touch. Light touch. Okay, our nose is still going up a little bit during these turns. Okay, let's hit two to try and raise our nose here. I'm going to use that third thruster. There we go. Two again. Okay, let's try and get out of this dive. Ah. Dang it, well, if we go perfectly straight and don't turn, you know, it works kind of well. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, well, now the nice thing with suspension steering is I can go up, or I can just kind of... Kind of just make my way over there. So now we're facing a little bit of a better angle. Let's see, when we go straight forward... Yeah, it's looking pretty level. It's just as soon as we start to turn... I start to lose it. Hmm. I mean, it's working way better than I thought it would be, because 
Frankly, I am awful at building flying machines in Scrap Mechanic. Ah, oh, dang it, I thought I was going to be able to get out of that turn. Ah! There we go. And that's the one. Well, guys, that's probably going to be it for this episode of Scrap Mechanic. I really like this one. Like, it's, it's, again, it's not working perfectly, but I, eh, I enjoyed building it. Dang it. Ah, oh, man. I'm probably going to tinker with it more off camera. If you have any ideas on how to improve it, uh, I would really appreciate it. Uh, if you have ideas, please actually flesh them out. Don't say, like, just try this, blah, blah, blah. Please actually, like, flesh out your ideas. And if you have something that you really think works, uh, leave, leave clear instructions. Look, look at the shadow. That's so awesome. The glass isn't sh uh, giving a shadow, so you just see, like, the engines and the seat. That is brilliant. <laughs> well, guys, leave a like if you did enjoy and want to see more scrap mechanic in the future. For the question of the day, uh, what's your favorite type of airplane? I'll see you next time. Bye. <laughs>